I am here with Reverend Jan Davis, the senior pastor of First UMC Rowlett and the clergy leader of the NTC delegation. Jan, it's the last day. Yes. We're winding it down. Yes. Woo! <laughs> Give me some good news about this general conference. The worship has been amazing. The preachers have been so inspiring. And what a great joy to be with the body of Christ in all its diversity, uh, speaking different languages, hearing different um, people speak and being exposed to different cultures all around the world, but yet we still have this United Methodist connection. Jan, as you look at this time of investing your time and money, was it worth it? It was worth it to me. I'm, I'm a different person because I've been at this general conference for these 11 days. It has um, touched my heart. There's been tears. There's been joy. There's been laughter. There's been some pain, uh, but I know that I'm stronger and a deeper disciple because of it. And here's the big question, Jan. How does any of this impact the folk back home in the North Texas Annual Conference? I hope that North Texas will see that they're a part of something bigger than who we are just in North Texas, that we're part of a large denomination that encompasses the world, that's doing so much good, uh, that is, is really impacting millions of lives, and that we have a future ahead of us. We've got some obstacles, we've got some things we really need to work on. It's gonna be difficult, but yet uh, God has called us to do so very much.